have a Zara haul for you guys today. I wanted to give you guys a few easy summer outfits that you could pull together as well. So we'll start with the first thing, which is metallic. And it is this dress. And I'm sure you guys know by now that metallics are definitely in for this season. But when I saw this dress, I thought that I had to pick it up because I know that I enjoy this style because I've also picked it up in a blue colour. I know it also comes in denim too and I am tempted to actually pick up the denim one but every time I go to put it in my basket it's sold out but I've picked up this silver one. On the website it actually looks like the silver is like plain but in real life it's kind of distressed with a white background. They do also have trousers like jeans that also have the same kind of finishing you could kind of see that there's kind of white underneath it i picked this up in a size large and it was 49.99 and actually it's called the fitted denim dress in silver so maybe the white underneath it is denim maybe it doesn't really look like it is it's got a split at the back and i thought that this would just be perfect for brunch i definitely think it is dressy enough for evening as well so maybe if i was going to a day party that maybe moved into evening or going to dinner with my husband or something like that i think that this dress would be perfect i have the ideal pair of silver shoes that i'm going to wear with this and because of the white underlay i'm, I'm probably going to put on my white jack mousse bag with this as well but this this style definitely seems to be almost now a Zara classic. They have it in so many different colours and I, I think it fits very well. I've never had any issues with this style. So if you are thinking about trying it out, then I definitely think it is worth giving it a go. So next I have another dress. I wanted to pick up a dress that was more easy to wear. A dress that you could just pull on, not really have to think about. Something that was a bit more comfortable for daytime. So I picked up this bubble dress <laughs> and... It is in kind of this burnt brownish colour. And if you guys are not a stranger to this channel, you'll know that I had twins about a year ago. So I kind of enjoy outfits that are a bit more dress dressy up. I am definitely an overdresser, but I also understand practically that I need things that I can wear with the kids and find ways to look a bit more put together that don't that doesn't take too much time and too much effort because I don't really have much of either. So I thought that this dress would be perfect for that. It is in a size medium and it was 32 99 I thought it was a really good price. I was slightly concerned about the length that maybe it would look a bit funny on me because I am six foot, but it actually looks fine. And what I really enjoyed about this dress was the shape of it in the middle. So it's quite fitted at the bust, but it is oversized around the stomach and the hips which is perfect for me because if I take my kids to lunch or anything like that, I don't have to worry about thinking about fixing myself or, you know, what is out of place and everything. It's just an easy dress to wear. I'm probably gonna wear this dress with a pair of flat sandals just because it's the most practical. And I imagined it with more of an oversized bag because I can, I can put everything that I need inside of it. I definitely think it's also, a nice dress for vacation, maybe with a nice big beach bag. So, and a nice pair of sunglasses. It is more of a thicker cotton, which I think is fine. It kind of just makes it feel like it's a bit more quality and it does have the elastication at the ankle. So it kind of really does give like a more of a bubbly shape, which I really like. So next I have a top and I picked up this ombre top. Now, you guys know that sun, you can see I've got it on here as well that these kind of sunset colors, sunset ombre colors are definitely on trend. So I couldn't help myself. And I ended up picking up two things in like the sunset colorway. So I picked up this bodysuit in a size medium and it's $17.99 and it is share, which I don't mind. But if you do mind, you can always put like a tank on underneath it, but I don't think I mind it. And what I had in mind for this, top was to put it on with a pair of jeans i have been outside i have been outside i have been like going to events and stuff so i thought that this top would look really really nice with some denim like a denim skirt or a denim pair of shorts and would be perfect for daytime party with a pair of heels or lunch with the girls with a pair of 
trainers or a pair of sandals i think that this top is really versatile if you wanted to you could also put it on with a pair of wide leg denim trousers whenever i look at this top it just reads denim to me like i feel like it needs denim with it to make it look its best i've been trying to think a bit more about my personal style and whether it whether it's, it reads more neutral or more colorful as much as i wanna like there's a neutral girl inside of me i think i might only be like a third neutral I really do love a color especially in summer so next i have a fail and i'm really actually really unhappy about this dress because i had really high hopes if you guys have been perusing the Zara website more recently, you'll notice that they have so many dresses with really nice cutouts, like cutouts in different places. So when I saw this dress, I thought it would be really nice, a nice easy dress to put on, but because of the cutout, it would be, you know, a bit of something extra. So I picked up this dress in a medium and it was 35 99 and the price probably should have given it away for me because usually when clothes are a bit more spandexy, they're a bit cheaper. But I presume that this dress would just have tons of stretch, that it was going to hug my body, look really, really nice. So I picked up a size medium, but I needed a large and I couldn't get it on. It is a fail, but guys, it is so pretty. The material of it, actually, it's got a zip. I couldn't get it over my head, but it has a zip. Hold on, let me see if I can get it on. If I am able to get it on, then you guys will see how super cute this dress actually is. And you'll see the style that I had in mind for it. The material of it is definitely a bit more dressy. I thought it would be super daytime, but it is actually a bit more dressy. So I think I'd probably end up wearing a heel, a black heel with this dress. Stick with your size with this dress because it's not super stretchy. But if you wanna try it out, then go for it because it is super cute. It is so hot. Guys, we are in we are in such a heat wave in London and I am suffering. I haven't filmed in days just because I'm so scared of these lights and my face, but I think, I think, I think I'm hot. I think I'm hot. But next I have a mini skirt and I am gonna style it for you guys, but it is a bit short. And I kind of knew it would go, was gonna be a bit short, but the style of this skirt, I just couldn't help myself. I have been looking at investing in a denim jacket. I do have the Mugler denim jacket now, but there is this Loewe jacket that I really, really want that has two-tone denim. And so when I saw this skirt, I thought, oh my gosh, it's like, it's so similar in terms of the inspiration. I wanted to just pick it up and try it. So I picked it up in a size large and it was 25 99 I think that is such a reasonable price. In my mind's eye, the way that I wanted to style this skirt is with a white blouse. And I think that's how I'm gonna style it. If, I'm, if I don't have it on style that way here, then it's probably because it didn't work. But I do have a shirt from Zara that is open backed that I think would be a really nice way to kind of display this detail at the back. Zara have so many and have for like months now at this point, have so many super cute, really, really nice denim pieces. And I just think that this is also one of them. I really, really enjoy this kind of double double denim look i'm kind of going back and forth about whether i'm going to keep it because i want to but i'm not sure with the weight i'm trying to get rid of whether it's really going to make any difference to the length of the skirt so it might have to go back but only because it's too short on me so and next i have the dress that i have on and it is so pretty i saw it on the model and i wasn't i know it it is described as share but i wasn't 100 percent sure how share it would actually be because the pattern kind of camouflages it a bit but it is actually super it's super sheer guys you can see everything underneath this so it's definitely a dress if i were to wear it outside of a beach setting that i would have to put on some kind of um maybe like a black cami or something underneath it just to just to hide my goods but if you didn't mind showing showing your underwear or your bra or anything like that then i think that you would be fine with it i just love the really rich colors i think it would look really nice with really stacked gold accessories but the colors to me give day so it's something that i would probably wear more in the daytime but it is super stretchy so i had no issues with the length i will put links to everything down in the description box but i just love this color i think it could also be really nice for brunch too and i love i love me some brunch bottomless brunch in particular but before i pass out in these lights guys thank you so much for watching let me know what your favorite piece is down in the comments don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next one Bye bye